Audio sick. Did you do that? Yeah, yeah. I have to do that, yes. <laughs> Fuck you. Sweet, let's go. <laughs> They're looting and looting. Oh, same came up with Vladimir Lutin. Oh, nice. Can't eat that. I'm gluten free. Nice. Wow. Which <laughs> is gluten free. All right, can, you, can you stop messing up, Ian? Definition of close up. If you have friends yeah. here, but you haven't got a spare bed, you can always have a loot on. <laughs> yeah. Nice, nice. We're here at Castle Fest. <laughs> Sorry. I'm trying to think of jokes, man. <laughs> <laughs> Do you want five Try minutes? not to use too many words, otherwise your sentences get quite convoluted. No! No, start the interview. Fuck that, Joe. Sign this up. Yeah, we're ready. Sorry. Yeah. <laughs> Is that an aeroplane going over We're right by the airport. Yeah. Just the worst. That was just a fucking disaster. Yeah, I know. <laughs> I don't know about that. Yeah. We've still got time. We're here at Castle Fest. I'm here with Palm Reader. Hi guys. Hello. 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 You guys literally just got here. Through yeah. About yeah. like half hour ago. Yeah. Like. yeah. Have you have you been here before, Castle Fest? We played it last year. It was yeah. very it's good. Different, different venue, wasn't it? Yeah. Much much yeah. weirder venue. Yeah. Yeah. Expanding. Yeah, this place looks sick. Yeah. I'm into it. Have you seen the stage? I've caught glimpses. It's yeah. got a wicked Axel Rose walkway. It has, Does actually. It? Yeah. yeah, like almost a catwalk. So you guys, you've been playing all over Europe, all over the UK this year. Yeah. How many shows have you played? Can you, can you count? Ever. <laughs> this year? No, just this year alone. You've played so many. Oh, I have. You can count. Yeah. That's cool. I don't know. A bunch. Yeah. So have you got like some standout shows that have just been personal highlights? Well, recently we played British Bristol Academy, Bristol Bristol Academy yes. last year. It's just yeah. fucking outrageous. Last year, yeah, outrageous. <laughs> it's massive. It's a big. That's a big room. Yeah. Yeah. Double bucket. List. There's not a lot. You, yeah. Just bu <laughs> yeah. Bucket list. Massive. Uh, what about Europe? How is Europe? Europe's always fun. Yeah. Like, it's always good. There's a few shows that are duds, but that's the same with it. Yeah. But they, but they kind of just accommodate bands a lot more. Yeah, yeah. So it doesn't really matter if you play into like. Yeah, the UK spoiled for bands, so they treat them like shit. <laughs> yeah. Whereas That's Europe, exactly right. The UK spoiled for bands, so you treat us like shit. Yeah. Castle Fest over. Oh, These man. are very nice people. We love you, Dave. Big up, Dave Brady. We drove through a town called Wank in Germany. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I forgot yeah. about that. Yeah. Wank Tunnel. Wank Tunnel. That's yeah, never yeah. not funny. Yeah. Yeah, there, there's another highlight. It's Bricks on the way to the academy and driving through a town called Wank. It's, <laughs> it's on the way to Innsbruck if you're ever in the area and interested. Okay. Wank Tunnel. Worth stopping off. So let's go all the way back. What was the first CD you guys had with your own money? If you can remember. Oh, oh with my own money, yeah. probably. Wait, is this like earned money or like Christmas money? Well, like you, you consciously made this yeah, decision your choice with, with this money the in hand. The first one I can remember is. Uh, Stereophonics and Tom Jones, Sex Bomb. Fuck yeah. Wow. From Woolworths. I bought wow. my first CD from Woolworths as well. I think it was Hybrid Theory, Linkin Park. I bought Life is Peachy. I bought Good Charlotte's first album from Woolworths. Is that the one with the, te the television set and the kids around it? Yeah. Yeah. I didn't listen to it. That was in the bars in Woolworths. Yeah. Good times. And now it's just in the bit. Are they still going? You heard their latest song? No. <laughs> Is it good? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Wow. You guys going to be playing the game anytime soon? Uh, Probably not. Yeah. <laughs> well, I have nothing against them. It's just not for me. Would you like to start a rumour about Palm Reader? I feel like we probably do on a regular basis without knowing it. <laughs> but I... Or maybe dispel some rumours that you've heard about yourselves, maybe. So I hit it with a break. <laughs> <laughs> so I hit her with a brick. <laughs> anyway, I hit Stevie next with a brick. Are you gonna? He's gonna have to edit this. Yeah, I'm gonna have to edit this brick. <laughs> <Yeah>. So sorry. <laughs> I don't think I've heard any rumours about us. Oh, that's what, yeah. You don't tend to hear rumours about yourself. I like the album Rumours by Fleetwood Mac. There it's a go. great album. Is that a rumour? That's more of a start this. We could start uh, a rumour that Stevie Nicks is your auntie. auntie. Stephen Nixon, and Marty. <laughs> Obviously, you guys have played like 50 odd shows this year. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Craziest or funniest moment of the big show the tour? Uh, I'm not sure if we get. We have 
many uh, like crazy moments as such. The guy who pulled his dick out at that show in Holland. Ooh, Saying that, <laughs> it, um, yeah, that's pretty crazy. That's pretty fucking crazy. venue called. We played it twice. Right on, uh, oh, Patron. Patron. Patron that in Holland. There's the stage. Yeah. There are people stand up here, and then there's a balcony with a window in it with like sinks for yeah, the upstairs bathroom. Yeah. And some guy got his dick out. Nice. Yeah. While well, yeah. you were playing. Yeah, that was both yeah. funny and crazy. Yeah. Big old pink. <laughs> in terms of like the funniest thing. Happened, I'd say there isn't one thing because we're consistently fucking hilarious. Yeah, I'd like to think so. Think away. <laughs> it's a fact. We are the funniest band with our name. Yeah, yeah. we are the funniest versions of ourselves. Your PR guy, your zero, he wanted you to fuck plug him. some things. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Fuck you, Harris. Do you remember these dates that you need to plug? <laughs> October the 29th through to November the 3rd, we're touring with the awesome Wilhelm. And a couple of the dates in Europe, Kundra, are playing as well. Yes. And they are fucking sick. So if you're in Amsterdam or Paris, come and see us, Kundra and Wilhelm. And don't get your dick out. Well, it's not frowned upon, but we're not. I mean, it is Europe. I mean, that's why we left. <laughs> oh. Too much right, dicks. Where can everyone follow you guys on social media and all that shit? Uh, Palm Reader Graham on Instagram. We are Palm Reader on pretty much everything else. And we are, yeah, we are Palm Reader on everything else. We are everywhere and nowhere. <laughs> looking forward to your set. It's going to be a sick night. Who, you, who else are you looking forward to seeing? Uh, Loath. That'd be good. Loath to see Tap. Loath to see Tap. Well. Check out our hollow, our form. Because we haven't seen them yet. We haven't been in the same place at the same time. Yeah, yeah. I don't think. Sweet. If we have, I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> Alright guys, cheers. Thanks very Thank much. you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.